Well, hello again. Uh, yesterday I put a, a small film on YouTube about my late father's chair airplanes. And I've had such a wonderful response to it. I, I didn't think anybody would be interested, but uh, you've been so kind about it and people have made lovely comments. Anyway, I've decided to do another one. So this time it's a little film I made about Dartmoor. In the 1970s I belonged to Tewkesbury Cine Club and we had a competition each year called the Holiday Film Competition. So when I went on holiday, which was usually Devon, uh, I, I always took my cine camera with me and, and made a little film about wherever I was, purely and simply, to enter the Holiday Film Competition. In this case, uh, I was down at Brixham and I decided to make a little film about Dartmoor. I just wanted to say a little bit about the film use because there are probably younger people who may watch this at some point in the future who have never seen 8mm film, so I thought I'd just show you a piece of it now. This is actually 8mm film, as you can see it's very tiny, and up in the corner of the screen I put a I've done a little diagram to show comparative sizes. Down the edge of the film, which you can't see in this particular picture here, but you can see on my little image at the top, is a little tiny magnetic stripe where we recorded the sound on it. It didn't come on the film, most of the film was what we call silent film stock and you had to put it on later. I'm sorry again about the quality, it is quite poor. I didn't deem it right to change the sound on this one. Uh, I left it exactly as I recorded it. Anyway, here we go, here's the film. Thanks for watching by the way.
flowing and ponies which live on Dartmoor. The animals one sees by the roadside are mostly crossbred ponies. Pure Dartmoor ponies are not usually allowed to range freely on the open moor, but are kept in paddocks by their owners. Thank you.